and welcome to my channel. I am Stephanie and this, these, these are three series that I think you should check out. So this is a video for VEDA, which if you haven't been watching, uh, is video every day in April. I do this challenge every year to challenge myself to put out a video every single day in the month of April. And not exactly sure which day this is going up, but I figured I would give you three series that I don't really, I haven't, I've talked about, I'm sure, on this channel, but that isn't in my normal playlist of things that I think you guys should go check out. Maybe I'm introducing you into um, to some new authors or um, a new sort of subgenre that you guys would enjoy in romance, but I think these are three series that you definitely should go check out. So let's get to the first one. The first series that I think you should check out is actually two sets two sets of duets and that is the upside of falling and the downside of love which is the first duet and the second one is the left side of perfect and the right side of forever all by Megan Quinn and I think that you should read these books in the order that I just said so Falling first, and then downside, and then you should read left side, and then right side. So in these stories, you are following a military guy, if you didn't see, <sighs> right there. It's freaking awesome. Both of these sort of follow the same guy for all four books. In the first part of it, he's only integral in the first book, and then some things end up happening within these stories that propel him into his own duet. But if you read all four of them, you will feel closure and um, goodness, I guess you could say, for this character and for the series as well. Um, and I am placing this as a series uh, for books because that one main character sort of flows through all four of these books and this duet is his his duet so it really follows him in these two books like i said he's only mentioned in the first book of this one um but the, he does play an integral part in the story so i definitely think you should go check out these books if you like military if you like heart emotional sort of feels to it. Um, there is a love triangle in one of them. So if that's not your jam, you may want to pass on the series. Um, but overall, the love triangle-ness of it does get resolved and it does have resolution. So it doesn't just sort of leave you um, feeling empty when it comes to that part of it. And the next series that I'm going to tell you guys to go check out is the Wrong series. I think that's what um, the ladies have named it. And it starts with Finding Mr. Wrong. Then you have Taming Mr. Flirt. You have Scoring Mr. Romeo. Craving Mr. Kinky. And Loving Miss Sassy. And these are all books by Joanne Schwimm and A.M. Madden. This story, the, it starts off in these four books, those four books right there, following some guys that are friends and then they end up sort of being with another girl sort of friend group. And it's their love story of finding love and happiness and just being, there's fun sexy times in all of these books. There's witty banter that goes on with them. Each one has sort of a different feel to it. You have a chemist, you have a um, really, really alpha, sweet kind of guy, possessive kind of guy. Um, you have a single mother story um, where one of the guys ends up um, falling for a 
single mother so you have a son and you know that play on things and stuff like that and then this fifth book right here is the sister of two of our characters that we've already met and she is a social influencer so all of these books have a little something for everyone and they're all super fun and sexy and just so much goodness i really really enjoy this series now this order may be incorrect for this next series but i think you should go and check out i don't think you can see them but um i'm not even sure what if corinne has a name for this series but it starts off definitely starts off with we own tonight and then you have one last time you have not until you and if i only knew so all four of these books follows a girl friend group and they are more they're older and mature um they're more in my age range so if you are looking to sort of find friends that are of your age going through some things then definitely check out these books you have um one friend that is dealing with some grief and loss another friend that deals with um sort of family things um you have another one that is dealing with um reinventing themselves and yeah they're all amazing they're all amazing and two of them the audiobooks um are freaking phenomenal i didn't listen to the other two on audiobooks so i don't know if they're phenomenal as well but the two that i did too i think it's these two these two right here um deal with an english british let's see yes <laughs> these are these have british um accented narrators to them and they're freaking phenomenal love them love them um this one deals with a boy band so if you have ever loved a boy band as a older woman like new kids on the block or Backstreet Boys, or um, 98 Degrees, or Boys to Men, any of them. Any of those sort of boy bands that we grew up with, this is, you're going to feel this. You're going to feel this. You're going to be like, oh, yes, I remember doing shit like that. Or I could see myself doing something like that in my old, you know, I was going to say old age, but in the, at the age I am right now. So if I was to go to like a Backstreet Boy freaking concert, um, no, New Kids on the Block concert, yeah, yeah, definitely would be feeling this. So go check out those three series that I just told you about. Um, I hope you'll take a chance on those books. I hope I told you that that last series that I talked about was by Corinne Michaels. Um, go find some new authors. All that information is going to be down in the description box so that you can go and check them out with the proper names and the proper order of which you should probably read the books. Yeah. Um, anyways, as always, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also, there is a feedback form down in the description box so you guys can help me improve my channel. There is a book recommendation form down there and all you need is the title the name of the author the genre and leave me your name so that I can shout you out if I end up reading your book um that you recommended to me this is I don't know what day of Veda thank you for watching me every single day if you're watching me every single day in April um I kind of want to keep these videos short so that you don't get bored with me but yes thank you Thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope you guys are enjoying Veda. Really. I just touched my face. Why? Anyways, I get delirious when I start mass recording. So, um, I think that's it. Thank you for watching, and we will see you guys tomorrow.